what is up ladies and gentlemen this is james with another james show welcome back and today we have another awesome video for you guys interesting mind-blowing mysterious unexplained videos for you guys to analyze with me hmm. and the thing is i'm gonna ask you guys before we continue i'm gonna ask you guys to subscribe to this channel with notifications on tell your dogs your cats your mom your dad your friends your cousins everyone come over to the channel hit that subscribe button with notifications on leave a like before we continue that is really important well let's just get on with the show now in 2015 2016 there was this extreme natural phenomenon that happened in japan it was captured on camera and uh someone pointed out late years later someone pointed out that there was look there's this there's this strange thing going on in this video isn't this a creature an unidentified creature a mysterious creature a bizarre creature it's not a human being it's not an animal what is this thing so i'm gonna roll this video and we can talk about it now replay the video pay attention coming out of the water this bizarre white creature comes up and climbs the tree or something behind the tree right all right so the video continues for many more minutes and this is what happened what is that what the hell is that this huge white creature whatever this thing is comes out of the tree climbs down the tree leaps once or twice and climbs the houses climbs up the house now this is um now about this video there are many people out there who try to debunk it and there are those who say state that this is the real deal that there are even higher quality videos out there of this higher quality versions of this video that show that this creature has actually two legs and so on and so forth what I was thinking is that there probably is a lo loads of mysterious things out there that we have no idea about. And if this is the case, in these extreme moments, such as tornadoes, hurricanes, tsunamis, and goes on, what if some of these unknown creatures that we have in our world surface for some reason and we're able to capture it on camera? I think this is exactly one of those moments that for some reason, one of these things that we have no idea that maybe lives uh, in our earth in maybe in deeper in the ocean or whatever it surfaced for some reason and tried to escape this natural this extreme natural phenomena i i want to know your opinion what do you think is going on now here? this next video was posted by buscador patagonico on youtube and let's just roll the video first and i will comment later but this is a heck of a video check this out guys Este, ya son como las 11 de la noche y la, la tercera vez que estoy escuchando este ruido de mierda es, no sé qué está pasando pero lo quiero grabar ahora para que y después en, en, me crea la gente porque esto nunca me pasó y, y nada lo quería grabar no sé yo estoy podrido la concha de la lora Tengo mi linterna para que invierta la tele. Dios. All right, let me pause it here. He's saying that he's hearing things. He works as a security guard, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong. He's hearing things, and this is something he never, never happened to him before. There is no one in the building. There is no one. There's supposed to be no one inside. There's only him, and there are these strange noises coming from the uh floor below him and he's going to go and check it out he's scared as heck and he doesn't know exactly what's going on so this is why he captured he got his camera and he started taping this he started he started recording it let's see what happens next <laughs> this guy's scared as heck i would be too oh my gosh Holy Pero como mierda puede ser que no haya nada. Ay. There's no one inside. Tercera vez. It's the third time. Que entro. No hay nada. 
There is no one there. Oh my gosh. Dios. But I saw something. Did you see it too? Let me replay this. This, this, this is something that he didn't capture. My gosh, I'm getting the chills here. This is, this is. I wish, I mean, like, this never happened to me, and I don't know exactly what I would do with it. I think the worst part of this video, let me just play this part. He, he goes inside the room, and this is what he captured. He didn't notice it. Wow. Right now. See that? Did you see that shadow? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yeah, did you see that shadow? That's not his shadow. That's not his shadow. What the heck is that? Is that a shadow person? Probably, yes. Um, there's a possibility if those things are real. And, uh, oh, this is a legit paranormal encounter. Let, let me just play the video to the end. Let, check this out. He's pissed. There's no one there. He doesn't know exactly what's going on. He's scared. This is most likely a paranormal encounter. Yeah, he's. There's nothing. Nothing else happens. Gladly, lucky for him. Um, yeah, but what would you do in this situation? I want to know. Exactly, how would you proceed? How would you, uh, or, you know, how, how would you react if you saw this shadow person, if you replayed the video, like you taped it, you got it on camera, you recorded it, and all of a sudden you're gonna show it to your friends and you see that shadow. Would you go back to work the next day? It's impressive. It's impressive how many weird things happen in the desert in California. And this is just another one of them. I'm gonna roll this video and let's check this out. Hmm. What is that? Now it just disappeared. We're here with you. They're, they're disappearing. They heard us up on the mountain. Wow, what's going on there? Then they disappeared. You know what? What? Wow. That is like wild. Wow, that was wild. Indeed, that was very, very wild. Now, what's very interesting about this video, I want you to pay attention because this is something I didn't notice before and uh, no one left comments or mentioned this in the video. Up on the mountain. Yeah, they they did. Did. There are tornadoes or uh, dust devils or something like that right where these objects were. It's very hard to say if these are uh, UFOs or something like that, or if this is uh, a phenomenon called ball lightning. Now, a ball lightning is a phenomenon usually that, well, there's no expl official explanation to what causes a ball lightning. All we know is that usually a ball lightning will happen more often during thunderstorms. But this is not the case here. We don't see, uh, there's no thunderstorm going on, there's no rain, there's no clouds, almost, I mean, like, this is clear sky. At least to me, it looks like a clear sky. And we have these objects in the horizon, and where, right where they are, we can see what's supposed to be tornadoes or dust devils or something like that, and I didn't notice that before. So this is why I'm analyzing this, and I'm seeing it now. Really, really strange, really strange video. I have no idea what's going on here. All right, so I don't know if you believe in telepathy or uh, telekinesis, these kind of things. Uh, well, supposedly they're real. There are experiments and books and even movies about it. And if you go deeper into this subject, you'll find out that there are actually people out there that supposedly can do these things. So I'm gonna play, first I'm gonna play a video from Andre Zatev, YouTube channel, and his channel is not so popular yet. But there are some of these videos that are blowing up, and I'm gonna play one of them for you guys to watch. Let's go. Oh, right, a mushroom. No way. He's not gonna. Whoa. The dog. 
The dog's face like, what are you doing, mate? Why are you not giving me food, right? That's what dogs usually think. Andre, you got real talent there. I guess this isn't fake. Um, I'm gonna play this video once more for you guys to see, but I guess there is no way that he could be faking this. Actually, I don't see why he would be faking this because his channel is not, he's not, he doesn't have millions of views. Uh, he's not drawing that much of attention, but he's got um, hundreds of videos on the subject. And uh, most of his videos are really convincing. Not only that, I think he's doing a pretty good job. If it is fake, he's doing a pretty good job at faking it. And if it is, if it is real, wow, Andre, congratulations. I mean, I, I can't tell. This is the thing I can't by watching these videos. I'm, I, I watched a few and I guess you guys should too go on ahead to his channel and watch a few of his videos. Andre Zatev, um, this is a really amazing feat that you, you accomplished. This is another telekinesis video that I have. Um, well, I don't know exactly where this is coming from. I'm going to roll the video. No way. I've tried this millions of times. Maybe, wow, no way. How the heck? Let me just play this again. There's no, you know, it could be like, there's there could be a second person with a magnet just under the table, right? Um, you know, but I, I've, I've seen people do these things live. What do you guys think about telekinesis? What do you guys think about telepathy? Are these things real? Have you ever seen them happening? And could it be just a trick? If it is, how are they doing this? All right, so in Indonesia, there is a channel called Benji Patulang and, and Benji does, uh, well, animal videos, basically. He deals with snakes, cobras, he goes frog hunting at night and all these things. It's very interesting because it's basically what he does and he's got like 8 million followers and it's a huge channel and it seems like he does very well whatever it is that he does. I've watched a few videos and it's very interesting. He deals with snakes, animals, reptiles and he actually tries to in a way teach people how to handle with these animals in the wild and that's kind of cool. Um, in one specific video, it seems that Panji encountered a strange creature at night with his team and they actually captured it on camera. At first, I thought it was kind of a joke, you know, kind of a prank or a hoax video and such. Well, I checked his channel out and basically he does not have these kind of videos. He does not do this. This is not his thing. And this video specifically went viral a couple of years ago and it's like uh, loads of people talking about it at the time and uh, well let's just roll this video so as you can see he's got a snake there he's gonna show us how to exactly handle this kind of creature at night it seems like he does it very well and that's cool as you can see he's not interested in um showing us strange creatures or i mean like mysterious creatures or any kind of, you know, that's not exactly what you, what you expect in one of Panji's videos. Now, a couple of minutes later, something really strange happens. Check this out. He's doing his thing. He's hunting frogs and snakes. And he's got him. I think he's ha he has a GoPro camera with him. He's got his cameraman. And there's another cameraman, if I'm not mistaken. And all of a sudden, they start hearing this strange, bigger animal, creature, in the background, is what happens. They hear something in one of the trees. I guess it's, a, it's an owl, you know, something draws his attention. And he, he's kind of pointing at it right now. 
But that's not it, right? There's something else there. Bye bye. <laughs> yeah, baru saya senang banget. Itu asli banget dalam artian. This is what makes this video really legit. Like they're laughing, they're having a good time, they're hunting snakes. Frogs. They have no idea what's about to happen. Jadi Panji edukasiin masyarakat di sini untuk enggak membunuh satwa liar. Jadi mereka lestari di sini. Senang kan lihatnya? Mereka masih bisa hidup bebas. Dan I have no idea what he's saying. mereka di sekitar sini. If you do, leave a comment. They continue walking with his team. Everyone has a camera. Check this out, a humanoid creature. Did you see it? Running in the background. You know, they do something a bit different than what most um, ghost hunters or creature hunters do. They actually go forward and they try to find it. There are other cameras, which is awesome. All right, so this next video is a security guard in Colombia. And what's about to happen to him is completely unbelievable. Check this out. I think he heard something. Went to check it out. Nothing strange yet. Checked it out. Apparently, nothing. Maybe heard something again. Whoa, what the heck? What? What? What's going on here? I think they're playing the video in 1.5 speed. But as you can see, these are probably his uh, co workers checking out his. What is going on? Oh my. All right, so we have, all right, so they went to it. He has backup. Oh my gosh. There's something trying to drag him out of there. Apparently something invisible. Maybe Harry Potter cloak, invisibility cloak, or maybe something else. Wow, his buddies were like, I'm getting the heck out of here. Are you kidding me? It all started when he was pushed by something that, you know, very difficult to say exactly what it is. Let's, let's see this part again. This is a really strange video clip. It's obviously a, a CCTV camera from a uh, workplace. It seemed this was in August 2021. Let me just check if this is, yeah, August 2021. Um, yeah, it, it's the Ar Armenia Town Hall. It's the mayor house in, in a city in Colombia, right? So they say that this town hall, this town hall is, um, is haunted. This is, there's like loads of stories of this place being haunted or, or whatnot, and you know, and, the thing is, clearly in this video, uh, this does not look like a prank. At least to me, you know, this, this... Mainly because you got these guys checking this video out, you know, the security camera and... Their, um, their reaction seems as natural as it can get, you know. What do you guys think? Do you believe in, in paranormal activity? Do you... Did you ever happen to... Um, hear some strange story from your cousins or, or friends or family. 
And do you think this is a real video? Do you think this is fake? Leave a comment. Now, if you've ever searched for strange, mysterious videos out there on the internet, you've probably come across uh, strange sounds in the sky, right? Some people say it's skyquakes. Others believe that it could be something else. There are a number of theories. Um, let's just play this video and you tell me exactly what it is that you think is going on here. This is in the Nevada desert. Supposedly, this video was captured on camera in 2019 or 2020. Let's check this out. That is weird. That is weird. And then the video ends just like that. I mean, I'm not too sure because if I was, if I were in this person's place and I was recording this, I would probably record it entirely unless of course we have only part of the video. Now, what's, uh, what draws my attention here is that, what catches my attention is that we have uh, a sandstorm, right? And this is supposedly in the Nevada desert. Um, this kind of sound, it could originate from some sort of industry. It sounds like a metal that is being dragged. Um, maybe something big. Now, it could be also some sort of sound effect or a sound from another video that was captured and recorded above in another audio layer in this video. In other words, it's fake. Now, this is these are a couple of theories that I have, and, and it could also be some sort of skyquake or a, a mysterious sound of a mysterious origin. Now, leave your comment, leave your opinion. What do you think is going on here? Do you think this is... Now in Mexico, and I could be wrong, this could be in Spain or other, another country. This guy was with his grandma and he captured these bizarre lights in the sky. Now what's weird about this video is that the same time this video was posted around 2018, 2019, two other videos went viral in different places, one in England and another one in the United States. And these videos portray the same thing. They all went viral this is the one that I'm going to show you guys right now. Check this out. What is that? Wow. Wow, me están dando escalofríos esta madre. Well, he's saying that he's impressed. There are a bunch of UFOs. He's hearing the police in the background. Anyways, this is... What is that? There are three or four of them. That is weird. Now, after this video went viral, loads of people started commenting that these are just, uh, this is a construction site, that because of the fog, the very heavy fog that you see here in this video, you can't actually see the machines, but they have LED lights, warning lights at them, right? Um, but why, you know, my question is, why are there two other videos that went viral the same week in England and the United States? The same event, the same thing going on. So it could be something else. 